What is automation technology? Your mindset and what the dominant industry is where you live will greatly affect how you view automation. Automation comes in many forms, maybe, maybe some you didn't know about. Automation and automation technology are such generalized terms that really they're loosely used to describe many technologies. One thing that they do have in common though is that they're used to take over tasks that were previously accomplished by people. This could be anything from applying coatings to gathering data or sanding or completing paperwork. Automation technology that involves automating uh, physical processes is generally called physical automation, machine automation, or motion control. Mostly this focuses on the automation of repetitive physical activities, whether they're simple or complex. Specifically, that refers to the design, control, and implementation of collaborative robots, industrial robots, CNC machines, machines of custom design, and lots of other things as well. And that's exactly what our company, Automation Experts, does. Often these moving machines that we make, though, will need to interface with flow control devices such as valves, fans, pumps, compressors, and other items. And this area of ex expertise is a completely different set of skills. This type of automation is most often referred to as process automation or automatic process control. It is a very common field in the engineering of processing plants uh, for food or hydrocarbon products. And it's also common in the oil and gas industry. Another uh, field that is rapidly growing is business automation. It's also called business process automation, robotic process automation, software automation, or sometimes even digital transformation. This type of automation mostly deals with information and paper and typical use cases are things like employee onboarding, document approval processes, filling out forms, gathering data, compiling data, completing background research, quotes and estimation, and many other tasks that computers and programs excel at and can complete much faster than people can. So I hope this gives you a bit more insight into the many facets of automation. If you have an idea of a repetitive physical process that you might want to automate, Get in touch with us and we can help you determine what the return on investment might be by automating that process and if that process can uh, even be automated, if it's even feasible. So again, I'm Stephen Bruce Wong and thanks for watching. Take care.